working with lady e today follow me as i show you step by step how i prepared my oven cheese and egg plant so right now i am trying to dry up my tomatoes because if you want to get a good result you have to first of all try your tomatoes to avoid having excess water when you will be baking it i just added in my olive oil the fresh tomatoes two garlic salt and then basil leaves then later i'll have to stir together and leave to keep on cooking slowly slowly as i go on to start preparing other ingredients So right here we are slicing our eggplant after which I'll have to dry it up with my kitchen towel just to remove and absorb the excess water that is in it before I will put and grill a little bit. So guys, the next step now is to place the eggplant on my kitchen towel. Make sure that the towel is very neat. You must wash and prepare it for this process. In order to use it and absorb the excess water that is on the eggplant. So from time to time, you have to stir the tomatoes to make sure that the water that is in it is well dried up because we do not need water on the baking process. So right now guys we're gonna be grilling our eggplants we are doing this just to enable the excess water that is in it to be able to dry up a little bit and this will also help to quicken our cooking process when we'll be baking the eggplants and the cheese so now it's ready So these are my ingredients. This is my melanzania. I've already grilled it just to remove the excess water in it. So this is my cheese. And this is my mozzarella. I'll be adding this too. This is my tomato sauce. I've already dried it up with some this basil leaf inside so all i'm going to do now is to start preparing my laying it down on this oven tray so let's start guys if there is anything you didn't understand please put it down on the comment section and definitely i am going to give you an answer so guys let's go so first of all we have to Pour in some tomato sauce on the tray. You make sure that you make it to touch every corner of the pan 
so that it will not stick on the floor so the reason why i have to grill a little bit the eggplant is to remove the excess water on it so that when i put it in the oven it will give me the density and the whatever style i want because if you did not remove the water it will not be able to dry up within the minutes that you are going to set it on because this you just need like 15 to 20 minutes in the oven at 180 degree and the the eggplant and cheese will be ready so now that i've put the melanzania on the tray you can see it i have to lay the mozzarella on top you try to scatter it because we still have the cheese to coat okay so you put a little bit the tomatoes again So you add the cheese and rub it on top. It's a very beautiful and nutritious dinner or food, especially for the vegetarians. Yes, so I love this. You can eat it without eating any other thing along with it. What I mean is, you can eat it as second dish, first dish, if you're not the too much eating type. So I've already laid all the whole, I've laid the whole eggplant here now. You know, we normally cook following the number of people you have in your home so if you have more than me you can put make it larger but i have few people in the home so that's why i'm making it as little as you as you me to so now i have to put the remaining tomatoes on top and to finish it up i'll pour the cheese on it then i'll put in the oven for 15-20 minutes and then it will be ready okay guys so see you when I'm true As you can see that my tomatoes are not enough so i have to add more fresh one sorry for that i didn't make it abundant so let me go get some more so i have to add some more fresh one this is multi I need to cover it very well don't worry yourself it will still be delicious <laughs> this is called kitchen management so we women we know how to amend whenever we find out that maybe we cannot get what we want we try to you know invent something to make it work so now it's okay you can see that 
the eggplant is being covered with tomatoes so now let's pour spread the cheese on top of it Oh, that it's remaining very little so that is it so guys see you in 20 minutes wow just look at it guys is it not appetizing it's calling calling and calling so now we're gonna cut some to test Wow, guys. So let's test and see how delicious this will be. Mm. This is Charlene Buck. It's very delicious. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time. Bye bye. Mm -hmm.